Hey folks, this is Dico here, and welcome back to Subnautica. So between episodes here, I went and fetched a couple bits and bobs off the bottom. I got some fish for breakfast, and we're going to make another battery before we go do whatever it is we're going to do. By the way, I hope you guys don't mind that I'm doing some of this stuff off screen. It's still getting recorded, just I run out of things to say sometime, and it's like, uh, I'm going to go chase down a fish. So, anyway, there's some of that. Okay, so, we either are going to listen to the radio and go do that, or we are going to go explore that deep cave. So, I found a quarter. Son of a bitch. Okay, uh, tails, that means not people. Hooray! Okay, so, let's make a few things here really quick. So, I picked up some fish so we can have some breakfast. You're not breakfast. You're breakfast. Mmm, delicious. Uh, I think I grabbed three of them, so we'll just cook them quick. Oh, and I grabbed a coral sample because I wanted to try if the bleach water is any different. So, coral two samples, you just go up to the coral tube and punch it with a knife. Bleach is an and essential chemical used for cleaning wounds and purifying water. That is true. Okay. So this is disinfected water, and that seems different. Yes, plus 30 instead of plus 20. Nice. All right, well, let's eat some breakfast. See, I've got two cured ones. Oh, I'm actually carrying two live ones. That's pretty funny. You know what, though? They rot pretty fast. Let's just... Um... Yeah, here, fine, whatever. And let's just drink a regular filtered water to get everything topped up. Okay, and then on our way out, we can make batteries, and then we can go ahead and we can swap that into our propulsion... God, I can't believe I've forgotten the name of everything. Uh, into our sea glide. I'm going to edit that back in, I bet. I would like to start building a habitat, because apparently that's super cool. But I do not have silver. So, we'll have to keep our eyes out for the silver. So, is there anything else I want to take? There's like a medical kit ready here. Let's just grab one and let's just use one. So I sustained some damage somewhere. So, okay, there we go. So we've got water, we've got gold I don't need but don't have any place to put. Because these are all full, right? Yeah, these are all full. Okay. Got an extra battery. We've got... Well, we've got everything, actually. I think that we are set to go have an adventure. So let's do that. Gosh, I love adventures. So, um, where's my submarine? So a couple things on this while I was floating around. Here's the power cell. So we can swap that out and put in a new one. And they're a little expensive, but not bad. And over here somewhere... Yes, there's this hatch thing for upgrades. Which is neat. I don't have any modules, and I'm not sure how to build them, but we'll figure it out. It's okay. And beyond that... Let's just go. How cool is this? Oh, okay. I have lights. Neat. Alright, well, we know basically where to go, so off we go. Oh, this is cool. And I know which direction I'm going. This is living the dream, folks. Living the dream. I mean, I'm providing valuable narr- oops. I'm providing valuable narration right now. Most of my brain is going, wee. So hopefully now when we get deeper, we're gonna find precious metals and stuff. Hey, whoa! Okay, so note to self, do not run into fish. Gosh, I'm good at this game. Okay. Well, whatever. I was just looking to see if there's any stones over here. Doesn't look like it. Wait, what are you doing up here? I thought you guys were... Wait, what? This isn't where this lifeboat is supposed to be. I am confused. And concern that something might have moved it. I realize that's probably not the case, but I find that scary to think about. Are you just salt down here? Yeah, I don't actually need any salt. Copper? Sure, I can use copper. Uh, limestone gives copper... Um, I don't remember if that's where silver and gold come from as well. Oh, hey, you've got big teeth. Okay, let's go back to the submarine for the moment. Where are you, submarine? Uh, submarine is... Oh, there. Okay. Ha. Everything's fine. What's this? Anything interesting? Sandstone. Silver. Excellent. 
And I saw there's a big chunk of a ship over there. I do not know if that's a place we've been yet. Did I scan this? I'm sorry, like, this is all very confusing to me. Bioreactor fragment. Okay, well, apparently we already had that, so... Okay. Anywho... Look at this big chunk of ship. Have we been here? I don't think that we have. It looks different to me. Well, let's go swim around quick and let's find out. I need to remember, by the way, that when I get out, it doesn't come to an instantaneous stop. Because... I'm going to, like, run into myself over and over again. Is there any good tech over here? Sea moth fragment. That'll just give me titanium, because we already know what it is. Hey, go away. Sea moth fragment, yeah. Maybe that's all there is down here. Here's some metals. Gold! Yes! Very good. That's salt. That's fine. That's just some wiring, because of course it is. All right. Doesn't seem to be anything interesting over here. It seems like this is all stuff that I've already... Wait, something flickered. Oh, metal salvage. Okay. And it's not that we don't need titanium. It's that I have very limited inventory space, so we don't want to go crazy right here at the beginning. Huh, this area's been picked over pretty good. I wonder if it was by me. Yeah, I see you. Leave me alone. This has already been very profitable. Okay, Seamoth. Let's hit the road. So now this is troublesome because that thing is not where it was supposed to be. The craft, and that was my beacon, more or less. So now, I don't know where to go. Let's kind of make a circle here. Yeah, I hear something very mad at me. Looks like it gets deeper over here, but that's not it. Problem is, I don't have the ability to make beacons yet. Yeah, this is just a regular cool arch. Well, this is slightly disappointing. That just totally ruins my whole plan. And now the thing disappeared. Where did it go? Does everyone have this much trouble with navigation? Because I no longer see um, that thing for the life pod. Did it just turn itself off? Beacon manager. No, it's on. Let's make it yellow and see if I see it. Stranded near a cave system and under attack. Oh, for the love of all, it's holy. Okay, well... I need to stop running into things. What is this? Look at this. Now, I know this thing, like, can only go down to 200 meters, so I'm trying not to get too carried away. Okay, let's hop out and let's take a look at stuff here. Look at this. What are you? Nothing. Okay. Oh, this is cool. Quartz, yeah, that's fine. Blood oil. Okay. Gabe's feather. Okay. Grows in deeper waters. I don't know how to get that stuff yet. More quartz, that's fine. We don't need quartz. There's some stuff up there. This does not seem to be where I want to be, though. A deep shroom, you say? What exactly is a deep shroom? Can be processed into hydrochloric acid. Yeah, let's take one. Because this is super deep. This is too deep for us to take our craft. So... Okay. Alright, well, let's keep going. We'll find where we're going at some point. I can't believe that cave system is gone, and the beacon is gone too. Like, that's really bothering me. 
Oh well. Okay, back we go. I mean, we have a lot of power, but our power is not limitless. And I think it's copper that I have to keep a steady supply of in order to keep making power cells. Yeah, it's only giving us that. Okay, well... Crap. Okay, where are we in relationship to the ship? I need to get some bearings real quick. Got some cool music. Ship is that way. Okay, so... Alright, never mind. Well, I tell you what. Let's tool around for just a minute. What I'll probably do is actually go back and check the tape from last time. Boy, I am running into a lot of fish, and that is not good for my poor craft. And yeah, this stuff gets deep in a hurry. Holy crap. Yeah, I tell you what, if I can't find um, that hole pretty quick here, we'll just go back and we'll check on the radio. Oh, this is so cool. Look at this. Look at this. I can go down here. Look at this place. Uh, here's a rock. Let's grab the rock. Uh, it was just titanium. Lame. Is there any more right near here? Like, this is often the stuff that I would trim out, except that this is really cool to me. What are you, anyway? A sh shuttle bug? And you, what are you? You're a spade fish, we've seen you. A shuttle bug, common scavenger. Necessary waste recycler, okay. Ooh, it may indicate cave systems. Well, we like caves. Oh, this kind of cave system. Okay, okay, um, hold on. Hold on. Where is our beacon thing? Pathfinder. Five. Cool. I don't think we're going to go in far enough that it matters, but just in case. Plus, I'm almost out of air. In fact, we're not going anywhere in particular. But. Now, do I just pick these back up then? Or what? Clear nodes. F. Okay. Okay. Neat. May indicate the presence of a cave system. A cave system, you say? Ooh, there's nodules down there. Yeah, and there's these big deposits that... Whoa! Depth reached. Hull damage imminent. Okay. Hey, check it out. I can use it as, like, parking lights. What are you? Nothing. Okay. Okay. Oh yeah, I have a repair tool. Why don't I fix my poor craft? Well, Welcome I hit the wrong button. Captain. It doesn't matter. Okay, well, let's head back and let's go get the radio. Not that I can see anything. So I'm going this way. This is pretty power efficient, at least. Our sea glider is not power efficient. Oh, check this out. Let's try to go through a little more carefully so I don't bang my poor ship up. Like that. Okay, at least if I bump it gently, it doesn't seem to mind. Well, that worries me a little. Oh, wow! This isn't where we were, though. This is something different. Oh, cool. Um, right. Any moment now. Uranonite? What are you? Nuclear power, you say? Sure. Okay, something went by that needed to be scanned. Look at this place. Is there any gold and silver? Oh, I need to learn how to make beacons. Like, I need to find one more thing to scan. Oh, cool. Look at this. A diamond. 
of the All Terra Corporation. You will be liable to reimburse the full market price. <laughs> Your current bill stands at three million credits. <laughs> So, there's just like uranium and diamonds and ruby and stuff around here, huh? Okay. That seems like it's a totally legit thing that could happen. Membrane tree. Oh, cool. Okay. Well, I can't take my ship down any further. Okay, hold on. Remember when I said something silly like, why don't I leave beacons so that I don't get myself lost? Not that this would be terribly difficult to find my way back. Lithium. Okay, that's good. I don't need it exactly. Gold. I do need that. Lithium. All right. I wonder why biodiversity is extremely... Uh-oh. Right. Air. I knew that. I just don't want to fill up my invo with all these other, um... All these other things. Okay, let's get some air quick. Yeah, 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 we're fine. Relax. Let's let our oxygen refill. We'll repair the craft. Poor ship. Not a very good driver. Okay. Okay, so this was really cool. So we found uranium and diamonds and stuff, and I have absolutely no way to tag it. So we're just going to have to hope that I can find it again someday. Look at this. Careful. Is that across her nose? Not up it. Let's head straight up and let's see if there's any obvious geological features that I might be able to find again. I've got to find the way to make beacons. Careful. Careful. And we're free. Yeah, this is pretty empty. Crap. Yeah, we're never going to find it again. Okay. Alright. Well, it is approximately 763 meters from somewhere. I'm not going to be able to go deep enough to look at these, but let's just tool around deep on our way back. This is what it's like driving with me in real life, too, by the way. Now, have we seen these before? Let's find out. They're amazing. An anchor pod, huh? Cool. They release spores, huh? Well, that seems cool. That's just what I want is spores. A gel sack. Okay. Edible. Well, can I grab it? Now I have a gel sack. Cool. It's too bad, by the way. Uh-oh. That suggests to me that there's a hot spring right there. What the hell? Um. Um. Submarine. Did you see that? I would like to really not see that ever again. Uh, we're out of here, team. It looked like it, like, teleported in or something. Did you see that? I saw that. Okay. There's some really deep debris down here. I guess we could scan this quick. There! There! I wonder if they're the ones that don't want us here. Duh! Okay. Well, since it just vanished, that means that everything's fine. So let's go scan this debris quick. Ooh, this is really deep. Um, it'll be okay. Please be a beacon. Please be a beacon. No. You're just quartz. I heard that. Holy shit. It's right there. Holy shit. 
Nothing that, like, appears like that and then decides to come towards me is gonna be any good. Oh no! Okay. Okay. And on that note, let's just keep going. That's fine. I'm sure everything's fine. Just everything is perfectly fine. This is exactly how things look when they're fine. Stupid fish, get out of the way. Are you just... A boring rock? Salt. Okay, that's not what I was hoping for. Okay, so let's recap, team. Um, there are scary purple things that teleport in and are scary. And they may actually be super benign, but... I'm just gonna assume that everything is, like, incredibly toxic and murderous until proven otherwise. And so far in this game, I have been right every time. Everything wants to kill us in some kind of surprising way. I don't know what that is either, but it's pretty big, so let's not go near it. Okay. This is fine. I love it underwater. Did you guys know that? I just love being underwater. I love that things just keep, like, looming at you out of the ocean. And when you can only see the bottom of things, because that's super cool, too. I love it. This is just great. What a great day this is. Furled papyrus, you say? What are you? Not immediately clear. Okay, well, I feel better then. Because it's not clear to me either. Uh, more salt. It's funny, I was talking to someone who was really frustrated that they couldn't find any salt, and I'm like, all I have is salt. Like, it's just all salt everywhere. Like, we're in an ocean, you know? Oh, God. Uh-oh. And away we go. Okay, you're a bitey thing that I know about. I want to grab these, like, materials. <gasps> Check that out! It's like a shark! I wish you could scan things from inside, by the way. Okay, well, actually, maybe let's not hop out near the shark. Oh, cool! Oh, that is cool! That they're, like, sharks, but yet they're extra cool sharks. Oh, my inventory's full. Okay. Okay. Well, holy crap, guys. This is super cool. Okay. Well, let's keep our eyes out for any big pieces of debris. But beyond that, I think we'll just head on back here quick. We'll make some food quick. And we'll check the radio. And we'll go from there. Well, this is a big piece of ship, but it's also got one of those things hanging out around it. Radiation detected, you say? Why? Why is there radiation being detected? Where is my... I would like to go home. Why is there radiation? Okay. Thank you for going away, radiation. All I want to do is scan salvage, and look what happens. Exactly. Now we're only 300 meters away, so now this is probably all stuff we've scanned before. So this game is beautiful, but the pop-in is not... is not as inspiring. This is sitting on an SSD, so it's like... Have we been here? I don't think that we have. It's full of sharp-toothed little guys, though. See? Look at him! They, like, take it away! Oh, this game is so weird. In a good way. I love it. Okay. They're over there. So let's see... Is this a thing I can scan? <gasps> You're a beacon fragment. Okay, does that mean I can make a beacon? Let's check real quick. Anything else to scan here while I'm here? Let's see if I've scanned them all. Nope. I have. Okay, anything else to scan since I can't pick any stuff up? Grav traps, we know how to make those. Okay. 
Now that I'm swimming around outside and looking delicious to these pointy guys. Welcome aboard, okay. Captain. Bitchin'. Okay, things are going great. I am extremely happy right now. And we've only used 80... We've only used, uh... 18% of our power. So, okay, let's go back. Let's dump our info. I may actually have enough stuff to start making habitats. Let's find out. Because I don't want to deal with these stupid floating things. Okay. Yeah, seek fluid intake. I'm working on it. Okay, let's check out our hall here. Alright. Look at all this stuff. Okay. So let's make a tasty fish. Let's drink the regular waters, because they're not... Vital signs. Stabilizing. They're not uh, as space efficient. Blood oil. Maybe processed into benzene. The hell you say? Advanced materials. Hydrochloric acid. Benzene. Synthetic fibers. Aerogel. And polyaniline. Okay. Beacon. Is just copper ore and titanium? That's it? <gasps> Wonderful. Okay. Let's make some food. We have some delicious peepers in our pocket, so let's make that. And... Well, I tell you what, should we start a hab quick, even though I keep promising to go check on those poor people? Thinking I might. So what do I need to make that? I think I need silver, and I think I only have one silver. Yeah, I don't have enough silver to make it. So I think that's going to have to wait just a little longer. Yeah, wiring kit and a computer chip. And that means that I need two silver ore. Yep, I need two silver ore. So if we find some more silver... And unfortunately, that means that I need to get another stupid waterproof locker. But that's okay. That'll let me store things. And, while we're standing right here, let's make at least one beacon. How much copper do I have? Oh, none. None more copper. Okay. Yeah, I have a gel sack. Highly acidic, yeah. The question is, are these things just going to decay like everything else does when it's cooked into my pocket? I mean, I could just eat it. Sure. Just clear out some space. We've got diamond, lithium. Okay. Wow, cool. Okay. So, let's go ahead and let's deploy yet another um, one of these things. The waterproof lockers. Okay, and in this one, we will keep valuable materials. We will keep things like gold, most of it, uh, diamond, rubies, uranium, uh, lithium, and I guess we can just keep everything here. I guess there's no reason to take it with us, right? Right. Okay, do I have any more copper down here? I might, because I would rather make one more... Um, Come on. I'd rather make one more beacon, but I don't think that I do. I think I'm actually out of copper. Oh no, here we go. Okay, so we've got a copper and a titanium. Okay. And we're good on food, and we're good on water, and let's make some more... Yeah, I hear ya. Let's make some more uh, disinfected water quick. There we go. Because that's just salt and one of those, I think, to make bleach. Basic materials. Yep. Bleach. There's salt everywhere. And to the guy who's complaining about it. No, no. There's salt everywhere. Trust me. And a beacon. Okay. Hot damn. Aurora, this is Sunbeam again. We just picked up a massive debris field at your location. I didn't know how bad... How many of you... I, I didn't know. We're now en route to your location. We're gonna bring you home. Sunbeam out. Oh, cool! What else can I say? The only time I parked a rig this big on a rock that small was in VR. And I blew it. It's a bad option, all right, but so are all the others. I feel like maybe he didn't realize his radio was still on. And instead, it's just kind of filling me with fear. Okay. 
Okay. Okay, well, let's go find some more materials. So we need silver. Let's go find some silver, huh? I like silver. Everybody likes silver. So, let's check real quick, because I keep ending up with the wrong stuff. So, um, not life forms. Let's see here. Sandstone. Sandstone outcrops is what we're looking for. But, before we head back out, let's go ahead and let's take a quick break. Because if you've learned anything, it's that once I start wandering, it's really, really hard to make me stop. So, as always, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.